What's happening, people? Today we are back with Pokemon Sword and Shield, and we're going to continue our adventure throughout the Galar region. So, uh, last episode we were talking to this guy. He's basically the Sem Gym Leader. There's a uh, other Ape Gym Leader who is. Why aren't your eyes doing that? You're not closing your eyes. Okay, uh. There's an Ape Gym Leader in this game, but that we have not seen yet. Himalok used to be the very center of the Galar region. We kept historical treasures in the vault. It's just upstairs there. Yes, the 8th gym leader is not here. It's just this guy, the 7th gym leader. But somehow he's, uh, he's much of a hyped up deal. So we are interacting with him. And he has something to show us in this place that's part of our history. Not our history, but the Galar, Galar region's history. You need permission if you want to enter the vault? Wow. Well, I got permission. Is that a TM? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Where are the good TMs? Why does the game really think it's a good idea to add stupid TMs in the beginning of the game and then build it up? Give me good TMs now. Just got really quiet. Oh, you're here. Brilliant, aren't they? It's just that there are still treasure uh, tape stories that can tell us wait tap tap stories tap stories whatever that can tell us of the Galaris history the two used watching a wishing star a disaster occurs the two bewildered youths youths <laughs> the youths uh, looking on at the sword and shield that stopped the disaster The use being crowded. These tapestries tell the story of the creation of a kingdom in Galar. I'm saying that right, tapestries. Say, young gym challenger, that's that. Uh, what sticks out to the uh, to you the most about them? The darkest day. Right. That's got to be it. It's right up there. Yeah, I see it. The story of the black storm and the blotted out that blotted out the skies was passed on through the years as a tale of disaster. What's what's that's what the darkest day is. Okay. Was there really only one hero or were there two? And what even caused it the darkest day? Thanks for letting me uh, bounce some ideas off you. I think I've got some theories now. I'm going to research the tape stories a tad more, but you have your gym challenge, right? I'm cheering for you. So take a couple of these. I hope to see more of your t uh, wins. Sorry, I was just thinking in my head. Um. So why is she studying up on this these historical stories instead of us, the people who have just should have been doing this centuries ago? If not years ago, or if not oh, back, like, why is she doing this? This has to be more scholars doing this. Is she a scholar? Whatever. I can't believe you need permission to go into that place. That's actually silly. I think you do that. The tapestries and the vaults depict the heroes of the Galar region's past. I suppose if you've gotten any Marn hero, it would have to be our champion Leon. Listen up, Leia. Your goal is to defeat the superstar Leon. So go conquer Rep 6 and train yourself up along the way to Stow on Side. Okay. I wonder what happened to Bahop, though. That boy got whooped. And I kind of lost interest in that story as well. <laughs> so I started stuttering and just going off in thought about what's going on here. Uh, I, can't, I can actually read subconsciously. Which is crazy. What a cute silicobra. Silicobra. Just look at those adorable eyes. 
It's our duty as Team Yeah to make sure Silicobra Cobra gets a nice peaceful sleep. What are you talking about? Oh, lady. Hello there, if I promise not to wake the Pokemon, will you let me through? Of course, I'd be... It'd be our pleasure. He has a... What the... Is that a bobby pin on his back? Oh, there he is. Oh, hey, Playa. Your head's so inside, right? Oh, right, Team Yao. Don't suppose you'll let us through. Now, you kids are way too loud. Can't be letting you through. We're not even yelling. And we're particularly not fond of kids wearing the challenge band. With all your stomping around, Silicobra is sure to wake up. Uh, his eyes are open. Right. What do you say, Playa? If we don't get past them, we won't be able to continue our gym challenge at Stow aside. How about them? You, yeah, that's the spirits. How about you just fight them? I'll just walk by. <laughs> you two are way too noisy. You don't want to wake up Silicobra now, do you? I swear to kiss these days. You guys are kids too, aren't you? Well, we've got no choice. We have to send you packing. It's all for the sake of Silicobra. What is with you two? So your premise is just to use poison types all the time? Or sunlight. I don't have a... Oh, I do need my meow. Yay! There goes my move. I can't use uh, that move now. It's gonna be really hard raising this Pokemon. Anyways, I'm going to switch into Surfetch. My bad. I need some better moves. Anything but this crap. Aftermath? Are you kidding me? Actual dark type. That doesn't matter. Surfetch essentially gets maximum crits every time it attacks. I kind of wish Surfetch had an um, ability that worked with crits. Like every time you get a crit, your um, speed stat will rise. Oh, what the? Oh, you're evolving. Capable of generating 15,000 volts of electricity, this Pokemon looks down on all that would challenge it. <laughs> Punk Pokemon. 
spark. That's a good move. Oh, should I really use this Pokemon? Doesn't really fit fit my ego. I think I'll leave this to you, player. Keep up the pace. I think I'll leave this up to you, player. Keep up the pace. You not gonna fight with me, bro? That was it. Uh, why do you have to be a bother? Why do you have to be a bother? What in the world? I can't pronounce that. So the Cobra might wake up after all of that ruckus. Then there's no point to us sticking around. Let's get out of here. We'll make these bothers some kids holler some other day. Play, you and Toxel are brilliant together. See, BD really wiped the floor with me the last time we battled. And don't get me wrong, I can't take a loss. Battling means you've got to lose sometimes. But. But he said that I knew it. But he knew that he said that I was dragging Lee's good name through the mud, being so rubbish like I was. And I just can't get those words out of my head. If I'm weak, then people will think Lee's weak too. But I don't want that. I can't get let I can't let Lee get dragged down. He's the undefeatable champion. I'm gonna have to take some time figuring this out. See so you around player. Dude, the only way you're gonna get this through is if you actually train. Stop using three Pokemon. You're the one gym you're one of the gym challenges uh, endorsed by Leon, aren't you? My name's Opal. If you want to know more, have a look at my leak card. I'll keep an eye on you, child. I want to see what I can do. I want to see what you can do when you go all out. You're walking real slow. Okay, I gotta wait till you move away. Okay. I don't know why you would walk around. Lady, hey, you honestly need to fly around or something. Anyways. Like I said, this point doesn't really fit my ego. Wait, does this tell me what Pokemon are in this route? It kind of does. Bag, Lee card, Pokemon. Uh, yes, Pokemon. I do have this app one. I could use. A grass type would be great. Because honestly, I don't have much for... Um, against opposing ground types. I don't have anything against... Uh, let me think. Water types, yeah, water types are a problem. But I'm gonna give myself an extra weakness to fairies. I do have a steel type Meowth. But for a Galarian form Pokemon, I want that to be far fetched. And for the rest to be new Pokemon. So I'm not sure what else I'm supposed to do here. I suppose Sir Fetch actually is it's a totally different Pokemon. It isn't actually far fetched, it's actually a. Evolution the far-fetched. So... 
I can put Dobbler back in the sea. Yeah. Hmm, I guess I could keep you... You don't really fit my whole ego. I know that for sure. Glaring me out for a stunfisk. This isn't my Meowth, this is a different one. Glaring Meowth I could put on the team. Uh, I don't mind him at all. He's something to take on fairies. He has a lot of resistances. I do like Stunfist as well because it's, uh, it can take on fairies and has a lecture type of immunity. And for my ground type immunities I can deal with that later. But I already have... Hmm. It's, a, it's a punk Pokemon. I know this Pokemon is going to be used off of one of my enemies. <laughs> oh well. Actually, my Pokemon heal? Not really. Actually, I'm gonna keep that. I know I have antidotes. My super cute Pokemon are interested in your Pokemon. That's odd. Don't have Psych. Don't have Earthquake. He crashed. It doesn't really work out for you. Yeah. <laughs> 
Un gros et un masque. Come on, man. Scorpy. That's a Diglett. Oh, that's a Dugdria. I'm just gonna kill you, honestly. Crafty shield? What does this Wait, wait, how did that have no... That's... Wait, you're a ground type. Uh... So you're, like, ground in ghosts? Yes, yes you are. Okay, so ground in ghosts. Even anything I touch that with, you're gonna die. I I don't have a. Oh wow, you have. Okay. Okay, so I'm have to switch out. So I can't switch out. I can barely touch you, and I can't run. Oh boy. I can't go for leech or bletch or whatever it's called, because I don't have my berry. Well, let's go ahead and head back. And what I'm going to do here is uh, take my bike. Actually, I forgot one thing. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to kick that guy's ass. Let me go ahead and heal my Pokemon first. Actually, yeah, okay, let's see. Grammar me out. Yeah. 
He is part of the team. I didn't know Spongebob would turn into this. I thought he will uh, turn into something a little bit cooler. Not cooler. I mean, he is cool, definitely. Just that he doesn't fit my... <laughs> um, my ego at all. It's a punk Pokemon. I know his Pokemon is going to be used by somebody who obviously thinks they're, they're a puck. Punk. Whatever. Also, I forgot to give that guy one uh, ass whooping. The uh, guy from the cafe. So let's go ahead and see him and uh, take care of business. I didn't forget you, bitch. I'm definitely gonna come after you. If I was gonna forget about you, no, no, no. First one to go is that uh, El Cream. Oh, that's going to be a powerful death in the Even if I use the revive now, uh, these Pokemon are still going to survive. So what I'm going to do is uh, attack uh, Slurpuff. Not good. Taunt? Yes, you can learn taunt. We're gonna pay day. Pretty useless. Alright. Toxic. That can definitely work. Uh, let's get rid of... Nuzzle. Mm. 
Yep. Wasn't worth it, but it definitely was for the XP. That's actually some great XP, but goodness gracious. Level 22. And what I'm going to do is actually keep my, um... Keep my guy, my poison type, in my team for now. Because, uh, he is very strong. I don't want to run into any situation where I'm probably going to get my ass whooped. Uh, anyways, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, we'll continue on this route. Maybe I'll train my Pokemon off screen. But uh, yes, thank you. We'll be back next time with a new episode. Till then, peace.